so here we are. This is how the new tripod works. If you unscrew this, you can bob up and down, but not side to side. But if you unscrew this, and now you can swivel it side to side, and it can't go up and down this time. Unless you unscrew all of them, put them in. Oy. But this will be really good because we can screw this in and easily swivel the film chains like they are being doing. Let's put this, I'm not going to put this on. Oh, wait. Way down here, the um, other tripod. How this one works is you unscrew this. And then you, and hard with one hand. So you unscrew this, turn it in whatever direction you want. So that's caused the jittering. The fact that this thing doesn't lock that well. That's what causes the jittering. So old tripod, which I'm going to use for the new layout over there. Old tripod. Last time, probably I'm going to use you. And by the way, let's see what the pan is on. Let's see what the pan for washing trains is like on this. Okay, now we're on. So there's the pan. Oh, and by the way, I was standing up last time for filming. And um, now it's on the tripod. It's basically the same height. At least relative. So right here comes the train. Where should we start? Well, we've already started. Um, let's talk about some of the features here. And then we get some nice clips of the train. More settings. Okay, here we go. One of the important features here is the junction with the siding down there. And the train's already here, so let's slow this train down. Do we stop? Put the switch here, so now it's on the other track. Now it's back of the track up and onto the siding. There we go. Let's bring it, and uh, I think we're good. So yeah, this junction has the siding with milk for those two. Down down there, we're gonna get to this in a sec. Trees, trees down, and over here comes the road in the other direction. And uh, what's up there? Stop the train here because all of it, two tracks. Let's not, let's talk about the car that is here and the siding. Imagine this before, it's a passenger car. Go back here and through the mountain. I don't want to hit that other train. No, sir. So, look, private staging so that um, we can hide this. Yes, we'll have it on the tracks. Um, what's our next destination? Other than that, oh, yeah, the rail yard. And let's also talk about some of the cars while we're there. Thank you. 
Intermodal cars. They came with the CSX engine and boost that you see back there. Um, well, as you can, they're basically the same except for the one back here has white containers, blue containers, and they are stuck on. There's no taking them off. There is derailing these train cars. What's wrong with me today? Um, but yeah, different couplers than the first train that I mentioned. Um, yeah. Let's now go on to the caboose. Here is the caboose. The one with the largest tendency to fall off on the upgrade. And not connect, but it's a nice one. Just like the engine. Um, let's talk about the stuff that didn't come with this. Here is our coal hopper train car. We don't have a sign for it, though I wish we did. Because it doesn't really fit on a train really. But it's a nice weathered train car. And with the coal in it, it's a much better upgrade from our old one, the, I'm sorry, old engine. <laughs> yeah, totally. Way better. And, um, yeah, on to the next car. Oh, my camera's, you yeah, know, let's fix that later. Last and last. for our last two cars, both the box cars. And, um, so let's talk about this one back here. It's our milk one. You saw on the siding. Beforehand, that we picked up. Yeah, we like milk. We got it. <laughs> and then there's this one. Doesn't seem that special. But, you can open up the door to the siding. That could be cool for some scenes of sorts. But, yes. I could have never forgotten this beauty. Our passenger car, Amtrak, see, Amtrak symbol, the ones with the Amtrak right there, so, yeah. Well, we don't have any Amtrak, we just got as a passenger car. It's a nice, it seems like a lounge car, it's, I'll take a closer look on the inside of the, yep, definitely passenger seats. But let's just. But yeah, um, it's a nice train car. Um, we're now going to show clips of um, the train running past points that you might or might not know. Uh, speaking of which, we have this train crash where it uh, just. Yeah, I think it's, why are you falling asleep on the job? Anyways.